This a a short clip of salmon that will be filet. It was freshly caught by a friend. Filleting a salmon means separating the fish into lateral halves, by the removal of the spine and bones on it. Sometimes it sounds complicated for a normal person, but it is not at all. Well, all you need is a good workplace with a sterilized kitchen board, a sturdy sharp knife in normal size, a big plate, and a paper towel. Here it is, you have did it. You caught a nicely sized salmon after waiting some time for a very tasty meal. It is a nice fish for a filet. You doing now the removal of its gills and performing gutting of the fish. Finally, afterwards the head and its tail will end up directly to the soup. The fish will be washed carefully and the upon cleaning, it will be all set to be filet. However, you have a problem. You like it in sashimi way. That sounds easy and simple. Let me show you how it was done without any hassle. Remember, use a sharp knife. Consider your safety when start cutting. First, let's fillet it by separating the fish into lateral halves. Hold the belly flap up and out. Put the knife in the head end of the fish, directing a cutting sliding along with an in and out sawing motion up to the end of the belly. Be sure to keep the knife slightly tilted downwards to the spine to be able to maximize the harvesting of all meat. Continue cutting until you are near the end of the rib cage. When you reach the end of the belly part, move your hand slightly from its pectoral fin and place it flat on the side, holding the middle body section of the fish. Maintain a good and precise slicing until you lift off the first fillet. This time, we need to remove first the skin. Starting a slit from the head area, then pulling it towards the tail. Until the other side will be separated from the spine and lift the fillet. Looks like easy on skinning but need a little forceful application. Do it on the other half as well. For the other part of the half, flip the fish over so the belly is facing you, head into the right. We are going to start the process all over again for the second fillet, which remain the spine. Now, you should have a two nice sides of salmon. We need to add an extra step by pulling carefully some bones remained. The easiest way to remove these bones is to make a series of sweeping motions in one direction with the knife angling up against the rib bones. Finally, prepare a sheet of paper towel on a tray, then start cutting the fish, guided how the fish bones situated in the meat. You can cut it in any way that you can recognize easily. If it doesn't look right for sashimi, then you are cutting it wrong. That's it. Little chilling to the fridge. Then you need a lemon, good soy sauce and wasabi to serve with. Don't forget to follow my Facebook page Filipinas Buyan as well as my Instagram and YouTube channel. Leave a comment, like and don't forget to subscribe to keep you posted for new videos. Thank you for watching.